Hey everyone, I am Milad and welcome back to our channel. Today we are diving into a topic that frequently asked by potential laboratory retrievers owners. Male versus female laboratory retrievers. Which one should you choose? Well, stick around because we're going to break down the differences and help you make an informed decision. Number 1. Temperament Let's start with temperament. Both male and female Labradors are known for their friendly, loving, and outgoing personalities. However, they can be some subtle differences. Generally, males tend to be a bit more playful and exuberant throughout their lives. They might retain their puppy-like enthusiasm longer than females. On the other hand, females are often considered more independent and can sometimes be a bit more reserved. Number 2. Size and Weight Now let's talk about size and weight. In terms of physical characteristics, males are typically larger and heavier than females. Male Labradors can weigh anywhere from 65 to 80 pounds, while females usually range between 55 to 70 pounds. Keep in mind that these are just averages, and individual Labradors may vary. If you have limited space or are looking for a smaller dog, a female might be a better choice for you. Number 3. Health Consideration Health considerations are crucial when choosing a Labrador. Some owners believe that male Labradors are more prone to certain health issues such as hip dysplasia or certain types of cancers. While this may be true to some extent, it's essential to remember that proper breeding and health care play a significant role in a dog's health. Regardless of gender, make sure to choose a responsible breeder who tests their dogs for common genetic issues. Regular vet checkups and a balanced diet are also vital for maintaining your Labrador's health. Number 4. Training and Behavior When it comes to training and behavior, both male and female Labradors are highly trainable and intelligent. However, some owners claim that females can be a bit more focused and easier to train due to their lower energy levels. Males, on the other hand, may require more consistent exercise and mental stimulation to keep them from becoming bored. But with proper training and exercise, they can be just as obedient and well-behaved as females. Number 5. Conclusion In conclusion, choosing between a male and female Labrador Retriever ultimately comes down to your personal preferences and lifestyle. Both genders can make excellent family pets, loyal companions, and even working dogs. Remember, no matter which gender you choose, proper care, socialization, and training are essential for a happy and well-adjusted Labrador Retriever. Make sure to consider your living situation, your activity level, and your ability to meet the dog's needs when making your decision. Thanks for joining us today on this discussion about male versus female Labrador Retrievers. If you've all both gender or have any additional insights, please share your experiences in the comments below. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell so you won't miss any of our future videos. Until next time, take care and give your lap a big hug from us. Bye-bye.